Hey everyone, uh, welcome to the channel. Today we'll do a hymn called The Trusting Heart to Jesus Clings. It's in the key of G. Uh, the time signature on this song is 6-8. And if you haven't done so, please do subscribe and click that like button. And I'll play it once and we'll break it down into parts. All right, so let's break that down into parts. The first measure. Okay, so hold the G chord and hit the uh, fourth string, which is open. Okay, and then we're gonna hit the third string and the sixth string together. And then the fourth, third, and then third again, but, but with the bass note again on the six string so it's third string and the sixth string together and then the third string on the second fret and then uh, open second string okay so it's okay and then next measure we're still in the g So the sixth string and the fourth string together for a quarter note. Okay, and then the fourth string on the second fret. Okay, and then back to the sixth string and the uh, fourth string for another quarter note. Okay, and then hitting the fourth string one more time. Okay, another eighth note. So it's. The next measure, we're still holding that G chord. Okay, so the sixth string, the bass note, and the third string, which is open. Okay, okay, so it's and then the fourth, third, and then that's open uh, second string and the bass note on the sixth string and then the third string second fret and then open on the third string okay so it's okay next we go into the D So that D, uh, hold the D, it will play the uh, third and the fourth string together. And then the second string, and then the third string, and then first string, third string, and then fourth string, which is open. Okay, so it's. So let's take that from the top, okay? So it's uh, okay. So the next two measure is exactly the same as what we played in the beginning two measures so it's uh okay so now 
the next measure we go into the C. Okay, so hold the C and we're going to play the uh, fourth and the fifth string together for a quarter note. And then the second string. Okay, so that's an eighth note. And then we're going to hold the D7, but uh, we're going to just make it keep it open. It's the second string and the fourth string together. And then third string and the third string, second fret. Okay, so it's. All right, and next we go into the G. Okay, so that part is the. Uh, third string and the sixth string together and then the fourth back to the third and then the first string second string third string okay and now we go into the chorus which is okay so the open second string and the sixth string together and then put the pinky on the second string third fret twice and on the third time put the bass note together and then uh, third string back to second string okay so it's So on the G, okay. So second string, which is open, and then the sixth string with the bass note on the third fret, okay. And then third string, and then second string, put the pinky back down on the third fret, and then uh, the third string and the bass note on the sixth string again and then the fourth back to the third okay so it's okay the next measure okay so the second string and the sixth string together okay and then the third string second fret and then third string open and then we go into the D and we're gonna hit the fourth string and second string and then third string and then fourth string okay so it's okay and the next measure is So that G, we're going to uh, play the third string, which is open, and then the sixth string together, and then the third string, second fret, and then second string, which is open, and then we go into the D again. Uh, so we're playing the third string and the fourth string with the D, and then second string back to the third. Okay, so the whole part, the whole chorus part up to there is uh, Okay, so the next part, uh, next measure is uh, exactly the same as the beginning of the chorus. Okay, and the next measure is... Um, okay, so it's a little bit different because uh, there's a one quarter note there. So the second string and the sixth string together. Okay, and then the third string 
and then second string third fret and then uh, the third string open and with the bass note on the six and this is where the quarter note is and then back to the eighth note on the fourth string okay so it's Next measure is okay. Hold the C and the fourth and the fifth string together, and then the uh, fourth string one more time, and then second string. Next T seven, but it's going to be open. The second string and the fourth string together, and then the second string time and the third string on the second fret and then the last measure we go into the G okay so it's third and the sixth together and then the fourth third and then second third and then back to the fourth that's it I uh, hope that was helpful in any way uh, and I hope to see you in the next tutorial